Uh, today I'm going to talk about the use, information, and critical thinking. Uh, as you all know, we are living in the age of information. The information uh, century is still on the go. So uh, let's say the information today you are receiving decides your future because it shapes your personality and your future purposes and intentions. So uh, the main source of this information today is still remaining the internet. The internet is a vast avenue that you can take any information in instant time. But still, we have, uh, we have huge demand for books. Personally, I prefer taking any information from books. It may seem a traditional way, but uh, in this information world, you cannot just differentiate a lie from truth. That's the reason why books can be pretty well, let's say, a uh, source of taking information or, let's say, knowledge, more importantly. About I mentioned critical thinking and use. Today, it's very important that youth should develop their critical thinking. In developing critical thinking, I think uh, IELTS is a very good source. Uh, is a very good strategy, I mean studying IELTS, because when you are uh, learning, writing and speaking, you will be given some chance to analyze any information or any simple question. That's the reason why uh, studying IELTS today is very good for young people to develop their critical thinking, especially when they are preparing their writing exams. You know, uh, writing is like two-side task. You have to choose one opinion and prove it through facts and uh, any supportive ideas. That is the reason why I think books and uh, analyzing information that's given on the internet should be, let's say, analyzed critically. And in order to develop this critical thinking skills, IELTS is a pretty good strategy, in my opinion. Today I participated in speaking club and organized it in the regional library of Fergana. I had very positive, let's say, uh, conclusions from this debate because I saw a lot of beautiful people, a lot of energetic young people who are eager to learn something, who are trying to do their best to develop themselves and growing personally, becoming let's say, an important person who can contribute any positivity to our society in general. And uh, I think in this regard, the organizers of this library and staff of this library are trying their hard, let's say, to guide, to direct this use to the future that they are going to build. And I'm pretty satisfied because a few years ago, there, will, there would be very few people, let's say 10 to 15, but today the amount of students here, amount of learners were pretty huge, you know, more than 50 people. That gave me very positive, let's say, inspiration. Let's say uh, this energetic faces, these young people, even little kids who are uh, aged six or seven, they're speaking in English freely. Compared to, if, uh, compared to two or three years ago, this, would, uh, this is, let's say, a huge change, a positive change.